Alright, what's up you guys? Welcome back to the Gentleman TV. As you might be able to tell, I'm still reasonably sick, so I have some congestion things with my voice. I'm sorry about that, but I decided I needed to make this video. I need to get one up. Uh, I didn't want to take a day off, so I am going to do this video. Uh, here we go, though. We're taking on the Portland Trailblazers. As you guys remember, my last game with the Suns was with, or I'm sorry, not with, against the Trailblazers. So this one holds a lot of weight for me. I mean, I got to win this game. I really want to get this win. And, uh, I mean, we've had a very interesting relationship with the Trailblazers. Also having them been the first team I ever played. But anyway, getting into it, I know you guys said I should use Dwight more. So Dwight getting the first basket of the game. And then Exum going in. You know Exum's got to do some stuff for himself right there. He's going to get himself his first points of the game on an and one. And he's going to make that three points with the free throw. So now we are up 5-3 to three here in the first quarter. But a huge, huge run by them puts us down by 9. Pretty crazy. And then Dwight Howard inside, putting the ball in the basket. <clears throat> I'm sorry. Uh, Seven-point game, though. A block. And Exum's going to get the ball back. And Exum taking it all the way with the nice slam right there. We got ourselves within 5. And then Exum again driving in for a huge slam. Bringing us within three, so that big lead they had just got absolutely diminished. There's practically no lead anymore. It's a one-possession game. But then down by seven, just a quick run by them again. They were having these huge, huge spurts of offense that I just could not stop. And that was really what was killing me here in this first quarter. But Daniel Orton coming up big on two straight possessions. And then Rondo with the ball, passing it to Dwight Howard. And Howard getting the ball in the basket, down by seven. And then down by seven again, and Dante Exum with a huge slam, bringing us within five. He had a huge, huge performance. The Dante Exum show is on once again. We were just on a commercial break right there. Oh, my God. Exum just absolutely destroying everybody. There's another slam, giving us the lead. He's going to see if he can hit this free throw right here. That's going to miss, but he ain't got no worries right there. He gets a steal right back, and he's going to get another layup to go in. So we got ourselves with a three-point lead here in the second. Jabari Parker driving in, and a nice slam from Jabari. We hadn't seen anything from him all game, but it's nice to see him come up with something big. So now we got ourselves with in two, and game tied, and Devin Harris. Devin Harris has been having a great performance the past few games, and I've been pretty happy with him. Daniel Orton also having a big performance. He's been putting the ball in the basket every single time. And Dante Exum driving in, making the nice layup through contact. And we're going to bring ourselves within six. This game kind of got out of hand for a minute. Still within six. And Jabari with the steal. Not knowing who to give it to. Obviously, you're going to give it to Exum on the lob. And Exum's going to throw down. We got ourselves within four here in the third. And Exum again driving in. And he doesn't even care how many people are in front of him. He's going to get the layup with the contact. And one. And he's, uh, is he going to, no, he misses the free throw. So he can't capitalize on the three-point play. But Dante Exum right here driving in and another easy layup for him. I mean, it doesn't matter how many people are around him. It's an easy layup. And then Exum again looking for a lane. He's going to find a wide open one with a nice slam. He's got that really generic dunk that he does, just two hands. But it works. And, uh, I mean, I'm happy with it if it works. Dwight Howard right there getting the layup. I mean, yeah, getting the layup off the rebound. Sorry. Uh, Kevin Love with the missed three. And then Dante Exum again throwing people down and throwing down. He's got ourselves within eight right here. And now 10-point game. Rondo wants to make it an eight-point game again. We're in the fourth quarter, though. Time is winding down. If we want to make this comeback, we got to make it right now. But we're down by 11. And Dante Exum gets the huge bucket right there off the and one, making it a nine-point game. And it hit the free throw, making it an eight-point game. So we got three minutes or so left right now. Dante Exum, he's going to get the ball right here. And Exum going out on the break. What's he going to do with it? He's just going to take it himself. Bringing us within two with two and a half minutes left right here. We have got to come up big. Down by four. Rondo gets his own rebound over to Howard. And Howard throwing it down. We got ourselves within two. This game is winding down. Down by two. And Dwight Howard tying up the game at 94. So we made that comeback right when we needed to. We had no other options. And then right there, Kevin Love hitting the big, big, big three to give us the three-point lead. And now still a three-point lead, and Jabari's going to put it in. We got a five-point lead. The free throws and all that are going to take us out of this lead. All right, we're still going to have the lead, but right there, Damian Lillard hitting the shot, 102-102. to 102. And now we need a huge, huge basket. 
And uh, Exum's gonna try to provide it with it, provide us with it. I'm sorry, but he's just gonna get stuck in that pickup ball animation. He can't really even get a good shot off. So going into overtime, we need some nice, nice possessions right here if we want to win. No stupid plays, no stupid fouls. I'm trying to cover the inside. I don't want him driving in on me. And then Dante Exum getting caught up on the screen. Not Dante Exum, Rajon Rondo. And Lillard gets the and one on us. Absolutely devastating. And he's going to hit the free throw. But we can come back from that. I know we can come back from that. We got to just get some nice plays right here. And Jabari Parker hitting a huge three right there. Making it 110 to 107. And now looking for some more action. Dante Exum inside. He's going to miss. And Dante Exum getting the steal and getting the and one right back. Maybe the biggest play of the game. Actually, no doubt the play, biggest play of the game. I'm sorry. Oh, my God. And uh, so we got ourselves a two-point lead. Then game tied. Exum inside to Rondo, who's got the layup. And we got a two-point lead with five seconds left. Now we just need the biggest defensive stop of our lives. Wesley Matthews inside. He's going to miss. And we get the rebound. And, uh, yeah, we're just chucking that up for the win. Thanks for watching, guys. Subscribe if you haven't. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I'm sorry I really wasn't able to be myself during this commentary. It's just being sick and everything. It's kind of hard to commentate. And uh, hopefully by the next video I'll be better. But look at Dwight Howard's performance. He came into this game injured. Something wrong with him. I think his like, left like leg or something. But just somehow has an amazing performance. So thanks for watching. Subscribe if you haven't. Uh, drop a like. And peace. I'm out.